Hello, my friends, and welcome. It is, is it Wednesday now? It's Wednesday. It's Wednesday, August 21st, 2019. I am the Drunk Poker Tis Beer Time. Um, so, I mean, we kind of finished Drink the Fridge last week, but we're really not done because we have to continue with this project because there is a lot of beer in there. Um, but today I got home and I felt to myself, you know what I need today? It's a big beer day. It's a big beer day. Now, this is not a big bottle of beer, but it's a big beer. Uh, from May, I think May-ish of 2018, comes the... Muddy York Brewing Barrel Age 1793 Barley Wine, 10% aged at sherry barrels. Mm-hmm. This is Folk had one the other day. This is a mosquito. It's a skeeter. I didn't get him. Anyways, what? No, so it really was there. I didn't. I haven't even had a beer yet. I'm not even seeing things. Um, Miss Folk had this last week, and, and it was her to drink the fridge. Um, for some reason, two of these ended up in the upstairs fridge, like behind the milk, like where we put the shelf to put the milk on. There was two of them just sitting there. I'm like. Hey, listen, drink the fridge is drink the fridge, man. So, very excited for this. This is a year and a half later. I believe it's aged eight or nine months in sherry uh, barrels. I've had it out sitting warming up for a little while. But I felt like a big beer day was necessary. Um, so, big ABV. Not necessarily big bottles or, you know, you know, huge 750. No, I mean, I have those too, but that's not what we're after. They had to be in the fridge. That was the rule. If they were in the fridge, we could drink them. So very excited. I do like a good body wine is worth its weight in gold. Dark fruits, caramel. I shouldn't have poured it so high. I can't really get my nose in there where I want to, but <sighs> smells utterly delicious. There's some dark fruit, a little bit of citrus, caramel, chocolate, cocoa. All right, it's going to cheers my friends to, to, to accidentally leaving beer in the fridge. Getting to play drink the fridge. Another week. Cheers. First of all, that was a really big sip of barley wine. Wow. So that is mellow, but boozy. So it's mellowed out the caramel. There's like a caramel note in there that is just utterly delightful. Sweetness with kind of that, a bit of the booziness on the back end, obviously, there's there's a warming, it's a 10% beer aged in cherry, cherry, cherry barrels, what, what do you think's gonna happen, right? But there is this dark fruit, uh, chocolate, um, citrus, bit of everything in there, that's, that's, that, that's, 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 that's crazy, crazy good. And the thing with big beer night is that you're not gonna drink a ton of them, it might be one or two. Because these are slow sipping beers. This is a barley wine. You know what I'm saying? Barley wine. It, it gets people excited. It gets them happy. If you like barley wine, it's is it weird to drink barley wine in August? Like it's like 33 degrees out right now. The sun is still beating down on me. It's like 38 with the humidex. It's hot out, and this beer makes me happy because I'm like, this is awesome. Because this can warm up. This is just gonna balance mellow. It's, it's absolutely delightful right now. Honestly, this is this is aged very very well in the last year and a half. It is, oh man, it's just lingering there, like my, my whole head is just barley wine, barley wine, barley wine. <sighs> I wonder what else I have in the fridge, only in the fridge, not the cellar, just the fridge, just the fridge, drink the fridge, barley wine. Cheers my friends, enjoy your Wednesday. I'm trying to slow sip. But it's real hard. <laughs>